season's final night market kicked off a new season tonight, the holiday season. Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm McKenna Alexander. With downtown covered in holiday lights and Christmas spirit this evening, our Andrew Banster was at the final night market for the year and shares all the spirit that was in the air. at the top of State Street. It's a little cold, but we are thrilled to bring people down here for the Madison Night Market and our seasonal lighting celebration where we turn on all of our decorations. As the final 2022 Madison Night Market wound down with dozens of vendors lining State Street, a six-week Shine On campaign kicked off with a spark. And the main focus of this is to brighten things up down here, to turn on a bunch of seasonal decorations, and encourage people to visit downtown Madison. And despite the cold weather, the Madison Night Market is putting people in the holiday spirits, lighting up the skies and showing giving is better than receiving. Free candy canes with the Boys and Girls Club. Thank you. So we're out here, we're handing out candy canes. Um, we got some great flyers too, and we're just trying to get everyone in the spirit for Thanksgiving and the holiday season coming up. Fundraising for scholarships for those who can't afford it to go to college. And we're selling hot cocoa and cookies, trying to keep people warm. To take a page from their book, if you're feeling grinchy, nothing will get you in the holiday spirit like helping others. Well, I was feeling grinchy yesterday, but today I'm feeling super happy, excited to bring people downtown. This is our downtown. It's your downtown. It's their downtown. I want everyone to come down and enjoy it. And if you missed out, there's still plenty of time to gather your holiday cheer. For the next six weeks, there'll be many things downtown. We've got a holiday open house next week with a trolley. We've got carolers coming every Saturday. The Overture Center is slammed full of good things happening, and it's just going to be a great downtown this year. In Madison, Andrew Banstrut, News 3 Now.